if you missed the last episode, I just wanted to say it was really, really intense. Like, one of the most intense starts to a game that I played this year thus far. Like, it was really, really crazy. So, if you're coming from that episode, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to continue with some more Lara Croft and her crazy shenanigans here in the Amazon forest in Peru. And uh, right now, we just got to look for some survivors, which uh, doesn't look like there's much. Because, uh, I mean, there was only a pilot. Me and Jonah. Jonah's probably on the other side of fucking the Amazon River because half of his plane fell off. Or not fell off. It ripped off and, well, you know what happened. Here we go. Miguel! Miguel was the uh, pilot, right? Okay. Well, maybe Miguel is alive. He only got hit in, in the face with a rock. Press... R3 to highlight useful objects. Okay, well, maybe we could get some herbs. Could be useful. Yes, it should. Where do we go to? Okay. Ooh, look at this. Okay, hardwood. Use hardwood to craft silence arrows on the run and upgrade weapons at base camp. Okay, this is cool. This is crazy how you... I have to craft a bunch of, like, stuff. You have to survive I'll the Amazon the forest. Jonah! Can anyone hear me? No, they cannot, Laura. Unfortunately, they're all dead. Hello? Mm. Anyone? Okay, use for focus mixtures. Let me tell you, this little focus mode is... A blessing in the skies. It, it, are they? it helps so much. I, find them. Ooh, I can kill those birds and probably eat them later. Right now, I just gotta f find my friends first. Okay, so we're gonna go up through here. Ooh, look at this. A tree full of monkeys? The Silver Crown Mountain. I'm getting closer. Ooh, what if it's not that much? Oh. Someone's over there. I have to get to them. That's Jonah. Head towards the flare. <clears throat> please tell me that's Jonah. Please. Please. I just... I just want to know he's okay. Oh. Fuck. We had a little bit of a rough time, but... You know... Shit happens. Oh, let me get them eggs, though. Can I get the eggs? Oh, just the feathers? Use feathers to craft arrows and... <laughs> okay, how am I supposed to get over there? Am I really gonna jump? God, you're crazy, girl. You are one crazy ass chick. All right, now we're here with a howlers. Big ass tree full of Tarzan family members. This. <laughs> it's not that hard, bro. You're not impressive. Relax yourselves. I can do that too. There we go. Woohoo! That was awesome. A fire. Someone must be around. Hello? Rough Jonah. landing. Miguel. Can you hear me? Where are you? Oh, what the f Oh, what is that? It's like some type of cow. I was thinking it was a, a dinosaur for a second there. I'm like, wait, are we in we in the right time here? I didn't know the storm would hit so hard. Ooh. This is all my fault. I should have listened to Jonah, thought it through. I never should have taken that dagger. I hope no one else was hurt. No other village destroyed. Okay, so... I need to stop these cataclysms before it's too late. Spend skill points earned. Okay, this is actually really cool. Training... In Seeker enhances Lara's exploration and observation abilities. Warrior increases her combat and weapon abilities in Scavenger. Enhances her crafting and stealth skills. Unlocking skills. Choose a skill to learn from the blue, red, and green colored boxes. Skills with white outlines have already been purchased and mastered. Dark boxes are unlocked when an adjacent skill is purchased. Some skills must be found in the world. Could I be purchased? All right, this, this is a lot of skills here, Lara. So we got three skill points. Um, never slip when grabbing ledges. More reaction time for traps. Okay, I like this one. 
Um, perform a stealth kill takedown without alerting nearby enemies. I also like this one. Okay. Automatically loot enemies killed by a stealth takedown. Review artifacts. Review challenge objects. Was. I like this one. All right. Well, there we go. So I guess we use campfire to light logbook. This is good. We use the campfire to upgrade our skills. Parts of the plane landed here. My gear is in that cog. Might be a sharp piece of scrap in that section of the rack. Okay, so wait a minute. Alright, this is another one of these fucking riddles. Damn it, Laura. Alright, so do we... I need something to cut that down. Okay. So we need to get our gear. Ooh, what is this? I'll need a tool to open oh, that. Damn, we don't have anything then. Shit. Okay. Maybe a piece of scrap from the rack. Alright. Well, cut a piece of the propeller off. <clears throat> Okay. Whoop. Jesus Christ. Damn it. Are you fucking serious. <laughs> Down we go then. Okay. <laughs> it would happen. Oh, come on, man. How many freaking A ship bit me. All right, you little bitch. You're gonna fucking die now. I've had it with your shit. Biatch. Yeah, that's right. Who's boss now, huh? Asshole. You can just come here and try to bite me, whatever you want. Cut the ropes holding your gear. Alright. Good, but it's dull. I need to find something to sharpen it. Oh, God. Come on, man. Is it really that serious? I can use this. Still need more though. Collect salvage a sharpened knife. Hmm. Okay, we gotta collect more. Again, thank you, God, for this little exactly instinct. What I was looking for. Just need a bit more. One more. One more. Where's the last one? It's gotta be somewhere here. Oh, I got some feathers going. We got some wild animals. This is great. Salvage to sharpen knife. Use hide to restore outfits and upgrade weapons at base camps. All right, cool. All right, we need one more of those little boxes. Hey, silly rabbits! We need to get one more of those boxes. Be able to cut this. Here it is. Perfect. Got everything I need. Should head back to camp. All right, let's start cutting shit down. Head back to the camp. Really? Hold on. It needs to be sharper. Oh, explore to find. <gasps> Ooh, I see what's going on here. Well, this makes a lot of sense. Inventory, weapon, crafting. Oh, yo, this is awesome. Makeshift knife, a handy improvised blade used to cut rope and stealthy take down enemies. Stealthily take down enemies. Okay. Oh, we just made a knife. God damn, bro, you're a fucking beast. Pretty beastly. Okay, new skills. What is this? We got new skills available already. One more skill point. Hey. Don't mind if I do. Never slip when grabbing ledges. More reaction time. Already got that. Reduce damage when falling. Visually assistance. You know what? Fuck it. We'll do this. Come on, Lara. She just made a fucking knife out of a propeller. That dude. should be sharp enough. That is intense, dude. That that uh, that is intense. Okay. Oh, here we go. Something's still holding the supplies up. Ah, there's a second rope tethering them. Hmm. Okay. 
Is it this rope here? Climb. And now what? Oh, shit. Lara. It's so crazy. There's a lot of things in this freaking... That's nuts. Okay, we'll cut this one off. And there we go. Now I can get my gear back. What is this? More feathers? I saw one of those uh, little loot boxes here. Now that I know that these loot boxes can be used to pretty much craft stuff, you best believe that I'm going to be using this knife for a lot more things than just cutting rope, man. Okay, let's go over here to our to our belongings. Now we're probably going to be able to get all our cool shit. Hey, what the hell? The fuck, asshole? That is badass. Why didn't I pack all my equipment together? That must be so uncomfortable, though. Like, you know, just wearing a freaking... Miss Croft? Anyone? Bow all the time? Come in. Miguel? Where are you? Damn. Rough landing. Survival instincts. Alright. Survival instincts. Here we go. Oh, okay. Well, this is this is quite quite easy here. Oh, actually, really quickly, I want to go here real quick. Because remember what I told you guys said that I thought... You know what? Let me just go check that place out real quick. Where is it? I don't remember where it was now, but there was like a bunch of dead skulls and shit was here, right? Yeah, let's see what this place is. Hmm. Alright. Is there anything secret in here? Okay, that's probably... I'll probably do that later. Um, I don't want to sidetrack my sidetrack myself. I th thought it wasn't gonna be so crazy, but the, the the music started playing. I got a little scared. So I'm just gonna go back to the regular story. I'll probably kill that fucking thing for hitting me earlier. But you know what? I'm a good girl. I'm in a good mood today. Okay, I found my weapons. I'm in a super good mood. All right, was there not a? Here it is. Okay. There we go. Now we can use this to survive the Amazon forest and go from point A to point B. What a coincidence that there's a pole over there and a pole over here, of course. Only a video game would be this practical. Alright. Miguel. I don't like this. Miguel? Where are you? Oh, no. Miguel? Miguel? Yo, what the fuck? Yo! Yo! But this is a man's boots there! Stop it. Stop. Stop it right now. Right this instinct. Yeah, who the fuck's eating all of these things? By the way, that wasn't a cow back then. That was one of those. Dude. Okay, let's follow the blood trail. Miguel? Miguel? Oh, 
Yo, chill the... Yo, chill the fuck out, you little bitch. Oh! Okay! They're hunting me. Okay, I'm gonna die here. Holy shit. Make it through the Jaguar's territory. Holy shit is right. Holy shit is right, Jaguars! You know I think y'all can fuck with me? Let's be civil about this! Come on, Jaguars! Jaguar territory. Is there man eating Jaguars, dude? What the hell? I think we've made it. Defeat the Jaguars. <laughs> oh! Hey! Hey! That's it. Come here, you little bitch! Wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute, bro. Wait a minute. I need a... Dude, I need a met up or something. Wait. Oh, okay, okay. R2 to craft silent arrows. Hey, 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 hey. That's right, you little bitch. Hey! Yeah, you like the taste of arrows? Yeah, how about one in your ass? Hey! Video game, I mean, Man, what the fuck is I doing? I just uh... yeah, that's right. Respect, mutual respect. Yo, what the fuck? Jaguar's like, all right, you know what? You're capable of surviving in my territory, so I'm gonna let you slide on this one. But let me just take this meal. My brother, you just killed her, my mom or my sister, whatever, and uh, I'm just gonna eat him up, so thank you for the hunting. Goodbye now. That's pretty much what happened. Trust me, I speak Jaguar language. I know what's going on here. Hold L1 and tap X to heal. Savage. Savage as fuck, bro. Dude, that was the most epic shit ever welcome to the Amazon boys welcome to the Amazon forest all right now let's get the hell out of here let's let's just get that all out of here cuz uh, God knows God knows that we got to bounce that was so epic honestly that was so freaking epic that was super cool. 
Oh, there's the other piece of the plane. That's where Jonah That's is. Of the wreckage. Jonah! Oh, there's a frog there. Can we kill that frog? Is that like a like a blue f Damn, I got no more arrows. Okay. Fuck it, just kill the frog. <laughs> just kill the frog. I just killed the frog. Oh, that is life is great. Wait, was that a frog or a no, that's a frog. There's no way it's a, yeah, it's a frog. Why can't I eat it, man? What the hell? These are jaguar scratches, by the way. Just so you guys know. Alright. What now, man? What now? Okay. Oh, how about a little nice bunny wabbit? Alright, so there's a bunch of stuff here that we can collect. Nice little fish over there. But, uh, let's see. Climb this rope up here. And, uh, missing gear. Progress past this point requires require the climbing axe. Well, ain't that some shit. Alright, well. Don't mind if I do. I'll just, I'll just go this way then. We don't have a climbing ass, axe. Climbing ass. Sorry, guys. Sorry. We don't have a climbing axe, so it's it's pretty much uh just uh on our feet here. These boots are made for walking. That's just what they'll do. Whoa. That was amazing. Okay. Here's the wreckage. The plane. Jonah, are you there? Somebody got eaten by a jaguar. <coughs> oh, there's the climbing axe. Oh, no. Yes, he's alive! He's alive! Yes! I thought I got you killed. Do you know what happened to Miguel? Yeah, he got eaten. He didn't make it. <sighs> What's wrong with your arm? Uh, some sort of parasite. I was looking for some warm wood, but it doesn't grow around here. Let me see, Rick. <laughs> what are you doing? If we leave it in there, it'll only get worse. Set. Uh, hey, we're just gonna take a parasite out of this man's arm. Uh, you sure you know what you're doing? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I had something similar happen to me when I was a child in Egypt. I won't lie, it's gonna hurt. You think that storm from earlier was the storm? The one from the mural? I don't know. Uh, uh, I think maybe we should stop and take stock. We've been pushing so hard forward, <laughs> flying into that storm. I didn't think it was gonna be that bad. I... Well, I should have insisted we turn back. I mean, I get it. You lock onto a problem and everything else just disappears. <laughs> Jonah? I, hey, I'm with you. It's my choice most of the time. <laughs> but if we die, who stops the cataclysms? Who keeps Trinity from doing what they want? Sometimes I feel like I have to keep going, and if I don't, then I'll just let everyone down. But maybe for the sake of a few hours, we could have turned back. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> maybe we should give him a name. Okay. Eli? No, my cousin. He's always trying to get under my skin. <laughs> Goodbye, Eli. That was nasty. Thanks. We should go. 
If we can find Kawakyaku, we can rest for them. Dude, I'd have sex one more time before dying. Sounds good. Straight up. You guys are slacking. Just fucking do it already. You got a river right there. Take a shower real quick. Bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. And get back to solving puzzles and shit. Cause I think we can see the village through the vines over there. May never experience it again. That's just me, though. All I'm right. glad you stayed at the crash site. Well, if you were out there, I wanted you to be able to find me. I had a flare gun, so... Yeah, I think Miguel was heading toward it when... We can get through here. Give me a hand. When he died. <laughs> or he got eaten up by a jaguar. <laughs> Alright. Now you hold my wood, and I'll go down. <laughs> Alright. Pun totally intended there. Ooh, there's a village over there. You see that? It must be Kwakiaku. We have to get down there. The mountain over there. All right, boys. Let's get it. Here we go. You sure this is a path? Come on. Stay close to me. This is definitely not a path. Okay. It's not a path, but it's something <sighs> that we'll have to manage. Oh. It's gonna break. Oh. I fucking knew it. Almost there. Almost there. Heard that before. This is gonna break right here. <sighs> oh gosh! God damn it, dude. You right? I'm okay. Just a couple more steps. Okay. Okay. You're right. I, I, I'm okay. I'm okay. All right. Well, here we go. We're not the only ones here. Who do you think built all this? It could have been the Inca. They knew a lot about hydraulics. The Incas, that's for sure. The bridge is down. Maybe we can lift it from the skyways. Maybe. Alright, cool. Sorry, dude, I just wanted to check some stuff. I hope that this structure is here because we're on our way to that village. Me too. Alright, so what do we have here? We have another puzzle. Let's climb up here and see what we can do. Hmm. Oh, what about you? This is interesting. Ever do Girl Scouts or Nature Camp as a kid? Mm, does boarding school count? <laughs> I don't know. Does it? <laughs> hey, that did something. I think the water powers the bridge somehow. Okay. Let's drop. Need to get the water flowing. What did we just do there with that? Hold on, let's check it here. Something's going on now. now. Let's go downstairs. Need to get the water flowing to the bucket. To the bucket. Oh. Won't you look at that? That just brought that piece of thing down. Need to get the water flowing to the bucket. Okay. So, what we're going to do now... Let's try and do this. Me and him. Alright. Let's go. Let's do it. It's too heavy. Give me a hand. Okay, here we go. The water's filling the bucket. Good. There we go. Let's see what those counterweights do. Very nice. Very, very nice. Ugh, the bucket's leaking. Need to get the water flowing to the bucket. Fuck me, dude. Jesus, come on. Okay, so what if we hold it here? Okay, hold on, hold on. There we go. Okay, Jonah, you can let go. That's it. There Let's we go. Very smart indeed. Yo, whoever puts these puzzles together, man, holy crap. You're a genius. Okay, so. Let's just jump over there. Alright, here we go. Guess we go through here. After you. 
What's that? I think it's some sort of stealer or... Help me with this. Sure. What is it? It's a recipe. Seems to be a mixture of herbs. It could help if we run into any more jaguars. <laughs> Let's hope we don't. Way out is over here. Okay. Eye of the Eagle. Hold L1, then tap triangle to use perception plants. Perception plants allow Lara to sense animals and natural resources. Yo. We're getting closer to the village. I can't wait to get back to civilization. That is so cool. How many times can you use that? Yo, that is awesome. Okay. These are different from the ruins in Mexico. So obviously this is gonna help us a lot. Anything about Peru? No, I mean there is supposed to be a secret city of gold in Peru, Paititi. Every treasure hunter on Earth is looking for it. But Dad's notes stop in Mexico, like he lost interest or. Or. I don't know. The next volume picks up in Syria. All right, let's see. We gotta read a bunch of these to get more knowledge. Passageway. That's promising. There we go. Thirty-three percent. Death Lords. Remind me how the riddle goes again. Chase the heart of the serpent. To the silver-crowned mountain where the twins confer. What's in here? How far do you think it is to Yaku? Assuming we're going the right way. Mm. Hard to say, but the irrigation system is a good sign. Right. Pistol grips. People were here at some point. Let's just hope they still are. All right, guys. We're going inside the temple now. Inside whatever the hell this is. I think we can get out that way. Okay. Two man job. Jonah, Come on, Jonah. Help me with this. On three, two. One. Oh man, if you let that go, it's goodbye. Oh shit! Shut the fuck up! You're gonna die today, buddy. You're, yeah, see, you're, 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 you're gonna fucking die. I'm sick and tired of your shit, bro. Come here. Sick and tired of being sick and tired of your shit. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Relax, bro. Hey, what the fuck? What happened to the freaking flame arrow? Christ, man. 
A little motherfucker, what a traitor. What a little traitor, dude. Are you okay? Help me with this. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at her back, dude. Oh shit. Your back looks bad. I'm gonna go make camp. That's the baddest bitch I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> oh shit. Got jaguar skin. She's sewing the jaguar skin? <laughs> okay. Yeah, random. Just Let me take a look at that. Casually kill the jaguar. It's not pretty. <laughs> you know, with everything we've been through recently, I've been thinking about my brother. I always try to protect him from my father, from himself, but I lost him. You did everything you could. If I had been in the right place, at the right time, he would still be here. If I had eyes in the back of my head. You can't protect everyone. Thank you. I miss him. I know. My parents. I miss them too. I had a dream about my mother recently. Yeah? Mm-hmm. It was so vivid. <laughs> when I was little, my father used to keep things from me. Hide things. About her, especially. Why would he do that? After she died, he thought they'd cause me pain. It didn't stop me from looking for them, of course. <laughs> I still have so <clears throat> many questions. Your dad created as many mysteries as he solved? Dominguez said that he would use the silver box of his shell to remake the world. If you had that power, what would you do? <laughs> Panic, probably. Hmm. You wouldn't go back to when your brother was alive and be with him again. Um, I lose everything else. No way. I like this world. It's it's not perfect. But everything I love now is in it. Got a little bit of a sentimental piece. After all the action and crazy shit going on here. To claim her treasure, the adventurer Lara Croft must outwit the king, reach the forbidden tomb, and solve the mystery of the White Queen. 
the way be fraught with trials. Laura, are you doing your best homework? The adventurer should not <laughs> dally any longer. In a minute, Dad! Whoa. The high walls of the castle beckon, taunting. All right, we're playing as little Lara. Let's go. Let's do this. Dude, this is, this is, is this really her house? Girl, you have been spoiled all your life. This is actually the most intense playground I've ever seen a kid, a kid own in their entire life. Strange beasts cross our hero's path. Hard to tell if they're bloodthirsty. Little Cara, Clara Craft. Our hero must be quiet to avoid alerting Whoa. the king. The alerting king was her dad. <laughs> what does Lara have to do with any of this? She's in her room doing her homework. Hello, Dad. She hasn't much time. She hasn't much time. It's a little bit of a. I want to say this is probably a flashback. Climb the castle. A flashback. Guard will never expect Crop to climb the castle. Hmm. It could be a flashback or maybe her dreaming. Okay, hold on. So. Hmm. How do we get there? We get around? Okay, there we go. That was dumb. This is actually super freaking cool. The fact that they're making us play as Lara Croft when she was like 12. <laughs> One of these pipes better not fall, man. This is a the castle tower is taller than she thought. This is super cool, dude. Isn't this kind of like what Uncharted did? Oh, hey, relax. They did that, right? Our hero continues climbing, looking for another way in. You played as little <sighs> Ethan Drake, escaping the orphanage. Our hero spies another entrance. Hello there, buddy pigeon. Ooh, that's a lot of shit you got. Done. Oh my goodness. Shoo, go on. You're shitting all over. That's not a pigeon. That was a crow. Never mind. <laughs> I just confused the crow for a pigeon. Okay. Young Lara confronts the extraordinary height and danger and pushes it from her mind. <sighs> Oh god, dude, this crazy chick, dude. If I found my 12-year-old daughter doing this... Ah! I'd probably kick her ass. <laughs> okay. Almost there. Almost there, Lara Crofty. Come on. Covers her footing and her goal now on the forbidden tomb. Oh shit! This is so. These parapets are damaged. She'll have to squeeze through. She's narrating every single move she does here. Unbelievable. She was born to be. She's so close. She can almost touch it, but an invisible force field stands in her way. There must be another entrance. She was born to be a tomb raider. Dude, look at her. Wow. This is beautiful, dude. Wow. Wow. Okay, she's her daddy's probably like some type of millionaire or something. For sure. Whoa. Okay, Lara, what the hell was that? Okay. At last, she spots a way in below. She will have to be careful. <laughs> Watch your footing there, sweetheart. If you Why do fall... I do these stupid things? Shit! Did she just say shit?
You're fucking crazy, bro. You're one crazy ass little girl, you know that? You're fucking crazy. At last, she enters the forbidden tomb. Wow. Yo, that is cool. Wow. How does one have so much money, dude? Like, shit. Look at that. By night, the great bat stole the queen at 30 north and 90 east. From her pen, she wrote her heart. With light, unlock her love's release. I wonder if the white queen is lonely. Okay, find the white queen. Find the white queen. The head of King David. From a shepherd to a king. Imagine that. Wow. A quotation from Chaucer. What is better than wisdom? Woman. What is better than a good woman? Nothing. Very true. Mid 14th century barding. Germanic, I think. I can't imagine how heavy those bardings were. Those poor horses. The king and the white queen. There's something in the shields. Yes, there is. Red and blue. Okay, what else do we have here? The poor queen, the sun king, Louis the Fourteenth, married Maria Theresa, ending a long-standing war between France and Spain. This is an old game. Two shields and a white crown. Could that be the white queen? Okay, what is this? Wait a minute. How do I... It was... 30 north, was it? I forgot the... How do I... How do I pull up the, uh... Her little thing. Okay. So, it was 30 north, 90 east. Okay, 30 north. Thirty north. Okay, here we go. All right, so the other way. Thirty north. Here we go. Okay, thirty north and ninety east. Ninety east. Almost there, boys. Nice. With light, unlock her love's release. Whoa. It worked. Okay, well, what the hell is this? Need to find the White Queen. We need to find the White Queen. Okay, so... Two guards and a queen in the middle. Two guards and a queen in the middle. Okay, let me climb here, see what the hell we can do here. This is a pretty decent puzzle to solve. Whoa. Croft has entered the forbidden mezzanine. She'll have to be careful. A Yatiri, a South American healer. Dude, this is fucking nuts, dude. I haven't seen some of these artifacts before. An ossuary. This box contains the bones of the dead. I can't read the inscription. 25th Dynasty. The interior of the sarcophagus is incredibly intricate. Oh. So now what? Oh. The great bat swings on the bar. Oh. Oh. Okay, and your dad is not. Your dad can hear any of this? I doubt it. I doubt it. Okay. So the red. The red. The. So these two red knights go here. Right? So I would assume this one goes there. Okay. This is quite simple, I see. 
Quite simple. The knight's shield reflects the light beam. Actually. Um, okay. We'll move this here. Thank you. Leave that there. We'll move this one. Actually, no. This one goes. Hold on. This one goes over here. I'm gonna put this one here. And then I will bring this one over here. Just so I can bring the red shield to where that one dude is standing. Here we go. It's not as hard as I thought it was gonna be, okay? It's, it's pretty it's pretty pretty self-explanatory. All you have to do is uh use a little bit of your brain. Alright, so this one. Okay, so let me see the, the. I have to see the. Okay, I have to see the design on the shields. Okay, and this other design. I think they're actually the same design here. They're different in the picture. We'll see if we have to switch them up once we put this one here. I mean, if you're born with a father like this, with all these crazy shit in your house, and you don't love it, then you're you're out of your mind. It's just super cool. There she is, the White Queen. Free the White Queen. Trapped. Oh no. I have to help her. How could we ever help the White Queen? Oh no. Okay, now seriously, how the fuck do we help her? How do how do we how do we help the White Queen? Let me see. Okay. Okay, how about now? Now I can free her. Oh, okay. That was weird. Hello there, White Queen. With light, unlock her love's release. Oh, okay, so now I gotta push these things from here. The White Queen goes in the middle, right? Yes, she goes in the middle of... Oh, shit. She goes in the middle. So she has to go... Okay. This has got to go. Sorry, but you guys gotta go. Yeah, you go right here. And, uh... <laughs> sorry, pal. But you go right here. Then I'll move this one. And then the queen is gonna go right smack in the middle of both of these shielded armored dudes. Whatever you call them. There we go. The puzzle has been solved, Mrs. Lara Croft. There it is. I assume. Nice. Amazing. Holy crap, dude. Cross the unknown threshold. What is this? Her heart pounding, our hero crosses the threshold into the unknown. These are mum's things. Oh, shit. Tale of the White Queen. Path was dark and is guarded by bats, said the Red Knight. The White Queen regarded him with a curious smile and said, Bats! I'm not afraid of bats. I'm not afraid of anything. Tell me about this. You and me are riding a T-Rex in Egypt. Where's Daddy? At work. Aww. This is 
very, very important. I cannot abandon my responsibilities just on the verge. You are always on the verge. Your obsession is destroying this family. Obsession? I'm obsessed. You are missing your daughter's childhood because you're always in some tomb on the other side of the world. Why can't you be happy with what you have? Yo, what? Please, Dad. Wake up! Dad. Don't leave me. Oh my god. Oh, fuck. I'm a dad, so that fucking... That hurts. See that shit. Morning. So, uh, Silver Crown Mountain? <sighs> I wonder what the jungle has in store for us today. Ugh, whatever it is, we'll handle it. Custom outfits. Benefits upper body, enemy awareness, enemy takes longer to detect and edit. Okay. Acquired. This is probably the, the Jaguar one. Okay, that's cool. Pretty sweet, man. And these are the ones that I got for pre ordering the game. <laughs> Some of these are pretty absurd, but some of th Wow. That is insane. Black tank and shorts, perfect for the dark allies of Paris. That is old school as fuck, dude. Wow. If you... If you want me to play with these on the next episode, leave a like on this video. That is insane. All right, for now, we'll go with a Jaguar. But uh, there we have it. Look at that booty. Reach full draw weight more quickly. Reduce time between charge shots. This looks, that looks important. And this one too. Resist damage from enemies for a short period of time after healing wounds in combat. All right. All right, guys. Where the twins How did you sleep? confer. I a dream again. About your parents? Yeah. All right, guys. We're gonna end it here. We are in the middle of the Amazon forest again with our boy Jonah. This game's actually pretty good, man. The story is very compelling. That was fucking emotional there at the end, especially because I'm a dad too. But anyways, want to thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you guys leave a nice little like. And as always, I catch you later.